I always kind of chuckle a little bit because the short answer is no. It has nothing to do with established religion, as you're aware of. Really, at the end of the day, it's about the human spirit. Does it have to do with God? How that really depends upon your definition of God. God, spirit, oneness, atum, source consciousness field. The point is, we are all connected. We're all one family. We all live together in this environment. We're all one species on one planet. My choice, your choice, they sometimes collide. In one solar system. And when those two choices collide, we must select the choice that's best for both of us. In one galaxy. If you want to call that God, then yes, it has something to do with it. In one universe. If you'd like to call it something else, it has something to do with that. If, if unity doesn't tie into that somehow, I, then we really must be insane. <laughs> Don't listen to me because I speak. Listen to me because I'm worth listening to. That's a choice you'll have to make. Look at what I do, look at my deeds, look at Jordan's deeds, look at what he does. If you disagree, be about your business. If you see what we're saying, hear me and hear what I'm saying is that you are special. It will take you to make this change. Yes, every single one of you. If we can bring the human spirit together, if people can come and learn from each other and open their hearts to each other and maybe explore a little bit more of what life is about, outside of this current rigid structure and system of what we think it is, then we can have a lot of fun and we can actually very easily change the world. It's like Bugs Life. Just watch Bugs Life. That's exactly the whole thing. Grasshoppers were nothing when all the ants worked together. <laughs>